I can't believe we made it. Are the people nice here? Nobody will attack us here, Hugo. This town is under the protection of the Count of Provence. He's a very powerful lord. I must say, this is beautiful. Are you sure the alchemist is waiting for us? Well, Magister Vaudan told me he'd prepared a house for us. An entire house? Yes. The Order is very old. They own houses and much, much more. They built your mother's laboratory, and even the Chateau d'Ombrage, remember? Yes. It's nice they give us a house. That's because you're very important to them. Would His Majesty allow us to enter the city by his side? I allow. Go take a quick look with him. Thank you. The house is in the upper part of town. It has a phoenix weather vane. Understood. And be very careful. Find anything you like? I like everything here. <laughs> Come, there must be plenty of other things to see. Where do we start? Well, what do you want to see? Everything! We'll try. <laughs> Hello, piggies. Roasted meat! Come taste it! Hear ye, hear ye! The Count Victor of Arles <laughs> welcomes you all to the yearly fair of St. John! Enjoy goods from our region and beyond at the market. Make deals at our fish auction. Have you seen? What? The people here. They're smiling. Uh, <laughs> it's true. Oh, look up there. The house with the weather vane. That's ours. Oh, right above the market. Yes. The view will be amazing. No, I still don't like them. But you know how to fight. Swords and rashes and cones for killing. For Renzi. Try it, my lady. Why not change your hairstyle? Thank you, but I like it like this. Huh? Good for you. A woman's hair is her righteous crown. Beautifully said. Her hair is nice like that. Well, thank you, sir. Nice as trousers around. Oh, this wine. A present for your father, maybe. He's dead, but he loved this wine. <laughs> well, he was a very fine man, then. He was. Thank you. This is some really beautiful furniture here. I had a closet like that in my room. I like to hide it. Look, flowers. Aromatic herbs, bombs, ointments. Oh, marigolds, roses. Oh, you know you're a barium. Only flowers. My mummy taught me. We kept them in a book at home. Do you want to buy flowers, then? Thank you, but we like to pick them in the wild. It's our thing. I understand. Enjoy. Yes. Come. Let's see the rest. Sure. Fish from Corsica. Caught this morning. Every four crates gets your fish. Come play. It's free. A gift to our visitors from the Count of Arles. A game? What do you say, lady? You look like a winner. She is. <laughs> All right. So how do we play this? You get four shots to knock down as many cups as you can. Got it? I'm in. Ready? Like the fair back home, Amicia. Easy. Go! <laughs> yes! That was close. Keep going. You hit a lot. Of course I did. What did you expect? You're our best player today. 
And you didn't even use your sling. I think we have to get going. Thank you. Goodbye, sir. It should be right up here. Oh, we can share my room if you want. Don't you want your own? Mm, I don't know. But that way we could invite each other to our rooms. Yes. I love this place. <laughs> Me too. Oh, they're playing music. Oh, I can't see. Hey, you know what? I'll put you up on my shoulders, all right? Oh, yes, please. Here we go. you down for a bit. <clears throat> Let's pick up the base. Yes. I can't wait to see the house. I wonder how big it is. I just hope they have real beds. I hope I can see the market from my room. A king's room, of course. Of course. <laughs> <sighs> Someone's had a long day. Hey, you're back. So how was it? They've got everything. <laughs> it's true. We'll have to go back all together. Sure. We need some fresh herbs. Look at that. I think we can call it home. Yes. Home. I haven't said that word in a while. I'm glad we came. <sighs> and I think someone needs to take a nap. I'm not tired. <laughs> sure. Let's go see inside. This is our door. Ooh. It looks quiet. And it's less hot here. It's nice. Ready to come inside? Yes, lead the way. We're home, Hugo. Our new home. Let's take a look around. Mm. Yes. All right, we'll do that later. Mother, where's Hugo's room? He's exhausted. Upstairs. The bed is ready. Thanks. Come on, you sleepy beast. You must come, Amicia. Come where? The island. He'll be healed there too. Healed? That would be nice, I'm sure. 
You're thinking too much. Sometimes it's better just to trust your feelings. I'm trying, but I... I get stuck in the logic of it. Substances obey natural law. The macula does too. You don't need logic, Lucas. You just need to be human. Maybe... I'm just not very good at being human. You are. This is why you have doubts. Today must have woken it. We had six months of respite after he passed the second threshold. But the balance of his blood is very delicate. Amicia, go with Lucas. Magister Verdan is somewhere in this town. Find him and tell him to come quickly. Right away. Amicia. I know. We'll be careful. It's because of those farmers. I should never. Oh. It's not your fault. How can you be so sure? You can't control what happens in his blood. The macula keeps evolving, pushing the carrier through different thresholds. Will this Magister Vodan really help? The Order has been studying the macula for centuries. If they can't, I don't know who can. Lord, protect him. Why hasn't Vodan shown up already? I think he's just being discreet. The order works like this. Someone must know about him. Let's ask around. Here, a town guard. I'll ask him. Uh, hello? Excuse me. Would you know the whereabouts of Magister Vaudin? Uh, I've heard of a Sir Vaudin, not a Magister. Try the marketplace. There's a couple of florists there. I think they deal with him from time to time. Thank you. Good. That's a start. <sighs> I should have known. Of course he doesn't go by his order's title publicly. We came by the florist earlier. It's somewhere around this marketplace. Hello again. Oh, it's you. Looking for flowers for the little one? Actually, I'm looking for Sir Vaudan. I believe he's one of your clients. He's my husband's client. He's the one who deals in medicinal herbs. Oh. But Morton should be right by the fountain. Just tell him I sent you. He's wearing a brown tunic. Brown tunic. Thank you for your help. Let's hope he tells us. He will. Excuse me, sir. Your wife sent us? Now, what does she want now? I'm busy cleaning this mess. It's not for her. We must find Sir Vodai. Him? But he doesn't like to be bothered. Just like me. Listen, my brother is very sick. We need him immediately. Oh. All right, all right. I don't know precisely where, but I think he lives close to the arena, down there. Don't tell him I sent you. Don't worry. Thank you. Right. Let's not waste time. The arena district. That's a lot of houses. How are we going to find him? There's mischief in the air. I can feel it. Yes. It's a slum. The order's not poor, so what would a magister be doing here? Probably hiding? Probably. <gasps> That symbol on the wall. The order? Yes. He's in here. No one gets in. The arena is off limits. Why is that? Because the Count of Provence said so. Get going, please. 
Listen, I really need to pass. It's all right. Come. We'll go around the arena. <sighs> Now's not the time to argue with soldiers. Let's look around. You're right. Sorry. There's a door up there. Yes. So, ready to break the law? Come on. Is it? The bite, yes. They've locked the arena down. They let them die here. It's starting all over again. Not starting. Spreading. Hugo. We brought it here. Let's find Magister Voda. If he's not dead already. I can't believe they left him to rot here. These people look poor. They must be from the slum outside. Nobody noticed their disappearance. Maybe nobody cares. Maybe. Here, another symbol. Well, let's get in then. You think the symbols will lead to him? Yes. Look, an opening up there. There must be a way to climb up. This could help. I'll give you a hand. If Odan's here, he's in trouble. He knows the bite. He must be avoiding the sick. Lucas, if all these people here were bitten, it means... <sighs> Maybe not. A sick person could have brought it inside the city. for letting you die like a dog. Damn, that's an ugly death. Oh, it stinks. Oh. 
What the hell? Oh, God, you oh, said... No! <laughs> Please, no! Not there. Looks like it leads back inside. Let's find something to get up there. Quick! Changed a thing. Let's go, quick. There's so many dead already. Like it's one step ahead of us. Yes, but none of them look devoured. Look, I think they were keeping count of the dead. They left a knife. It's stuck. Come on. Let's keep going. Through that. You don't use blades against people. I did. I have no choice. A blade is silent and quick. It's what we need now. All right. It's up to you. symbol. Good, but Dukas, if these people fell ill, it means some must have been bitten. I've seen no signs of attack. Not yet. Anyway, let's go. Soldiers doing bad. That doesn't sound good. Crows! Anybody want some roasted bird? Archer, up there. You just shot a dead body, you idiot! Oh, come on! They looked right when I shot! Stop playing and keep your eyes open. Or you'll be explaining to Arno why we're empty-handed when he arrives. Soldiers, that I can do. But this, nah, you can't fight a plague like this.
was that noise? mercenaries, all the bloody scum that keeps getting in our way. Chaos rules our lives. They're part of it. And you're getting better at handling them. I see it. You were pretty discreet back there. Well, better to let live and not risk dying myself. You smell that? Dead bodies. What is this place? A hospital. I think they used to live here. No wonder they all fell ill. I can't get used to it. You don't have to. Please tell me this is it. Just live in a high tower, no? Let's just get there. 